1.2.2 Decomposition Reaction Have you noticed that the green color of the ferrous sulfate crystals has changed? You can also smell the characteristic odor of burning sulfur. In this reaction you can observe that a single reactant breaks down to give simpler products. This is a decomposition reaction. Ferrous sulfate crystals lose water when heated and the color of the crystals changes. It then decomposes to ferric oxide, sulfur dioxide, and sulfur trioxide. Decomposition of calcium carbonate to calcium oxide and carbon dioxide on heating is an important decomposition reaction used in various industries. Calcium oxide is called lime or quick lime. It has many uses, one is in the manufacture of cement. When a decomposition reaction is carried out by heating, it is called thermal decomposition. It has many uses, one is in the manufacture of cement. When a decomposition reaction is carried out by heating, it is called thermal decomposition. You will observe the emission of brown fumes. These fumes are of nitrogen dioxide, NO2. The reaction that takes place is dash. You will see that white silver chloride turns gray in sunlight. This is due to the decomposition of silver chloride into silver and chlorine by light. Silver bromide also behaves in the same way. The above reactions are used in black and white photography. What form of energy is causing these decomposition reactions? We have seen that the decomposition reactions require energy either in the form of heat, light or electricity for breaking down the reactants. Reactions in which energy is absorbed are known as endothermic reactions.